Hello and welcome back everyone to Human Resource Machine. We are going to take a look at year 36, the alphabetizer. So what we're going to do is we take from the inbox, it contains two words, so zero terminated strings. Uh, we are supposed to determine which word comes first if you were to order them alphabetically. So either one is shorter, one has a letter in the alphabet at some point that is uh, further um, to the left in the alphabet and then send only that word to the outbox. So first things first, um, this is where, why I marked this here. First things first, we copy both words to the floor. So let's let's just have a quick look at it. I mean, there's really no surprise how that works. We take from the inbox, store it somewhere, uh, increment an index and then add a zero at the end, which we also take from the uh, inbox. So really no. No surprises there. So once that's copied, we take from 24, which is 10. Copy that to one of, we have two indexes here. We have uh, the right and the left index. Uh, so we copy 24, which is 10 to the index. So we start at the second word at 10. Uh, we copy from uh, 23, which is zero to the leftmost index. Um, then what we do is uh, we copy from the leftmost index. If that is zero, we know that um, either our second, or well, sorry, uh, yeah, restart that, whatever. Um, so we know that we have reached the end of the f of the first word. Um, if that is zero, then we can just um, output the second one. Uh, we copy from the second index. If that is zero, we've reached the end of that word, so we know that the first one is shorter. Um, if not, neither of them is zero, we can subtract the f the letter we have in the first word from the one that is in the second word. And then again, if it's zero, they are the same, so we can go on. We just bump up both of our indexes. If it's negative, we know that the uh, first word is, well, the, the first value, the, the value in the first word is bigger, so we have to output the first word. Um, in case it's the other way around, it's obviously the other way around as well. So either we have to output the word the word starting at uh, zero, so at uh, index twenty three, or we have to output the word that starts at index ten, so the twenty four. Um, in any case, um, we initiate our indexes essentially so we copy from um, well we don't actually copy we don't need to re-index re we can actually just use both of these fields as indexes so that's what I'm doing here I copy from what is in either 23 or 24 then I outbox um, if it's zero then um, I reach the end I don't have to outbox the zero if it's not a zero I just outbox bump up the index either the 23 or the 24 and then just loop until I've reached the end of the word. So let's just let's just quickly see how that looks. First, we do the copy step. So it's either uncap or undo. Uh, uncap is obviously the smaller one, as it has the C, where the other one has AD. So what we do now is we gradually um, compare. So. In this case, we compared U and U, which is the same, so we just go on, the N and the N, which is the same, so we can, again, just bump up both of our indexes. Now we're looking at index 2 and index 12. So what it'll do is it'll take from the first word, subtract what's in the second one. Well, first of all, we have to compare for zero. That's always the case, but in, we, we're not at zero. So we can now take um, what we have in the second word, subtract what's in the first one. That is not zero, so we uh, do not go on. We know that there's one word bigger than the other. In this case, it's a one, so we know that um, the first word is the smaller one, i.e. it is uh, earlier in the alphabet. And so we take from 23, the U, well, from uh, what's indexed by, by 23. And then really just iterate through the word. And outbox it. Okay. 
So we got exactly 39 commands. And 108 steps. So both challenges in one, and that's year 36 alphabetizer. See you next time.